Hello and welcome to the new install for Blender config add-on. So we are working with Blender 4.3 long-term support. You can either get it from blender.org here or the blender uh, builder.blender.org site where they have the daily builds. So to find that, if you go into just the main page and go to all archived builds, then you can scroll down and get your long-term support. So we're working with uh, any of these will be fine. Actually, the 4.3.1. Okay. So if you're installing it to the main Blender uh, installation, which would be off of blender.org, uh, you'll locate that under local disk, program files, uh, Blender foundation, and then Blender 4.3. We today are going to install to the Blender build. So I have that installed to my desktop. So I'm gonna go ahead and open that up. Um, and then I'm gonna go ahead and open up the zip that I downloaded off of Gumroad, which when you open it will look like this. So before we used to install to a, a config folder, that was contained within the 4.3 folder. So this new version is a little bit different. We have a portable folder and within inside the portable folder is your config folder. And so I'm just going to copy and paste the contents of that portable folder into the main blender build directory. Okay. So, and within that, contains your config, your scripts, uh, presets, whatnot, uh, your interface theme. And then I like to also put in the scripts. If we go to 4.3 again, scripts, startup, and then I'm going to grab all of these, copy, and paste them in. So that's there, that's there. And then we can go ahead and open up Blender by right clicking on it and run as administrator. Now, once you're in Blender, you can, um, you can right click and you should see your marking menu. And then you'll know that your hotkey uh, stuff is working and installed. In the event that it's not working, you can go up to Edit, Preferences, go to Import, and then locate that folder where you have uh, your Blender installed to. So I'm going to go here, go to 4.3, Scripts, Startup, and then just select the FA Hotkeys or FA underscore hotkeys.py and import key configuration. Okay, so that should get you up and running for Maya config add-on. Uh, if you have any questions, be sure to leave it in the comments below and I hope, hope you guys enjoy the config. Take care.